We need to protect ourselves from AI. I don't like AI and here's why. That was an unfortunate rhyme. I could go into how it's taken over our jobs, but I'm worried about it taking over the world because, because, because of the not so wonderful things that it does, what AI and robots are doing is better than how we do them. It's, it, they, they do it better, watch this. Can you multiply 36,512 times 17,429? I can't, but the robot can. Echo. What's 36,512 times 17,429? 36,512 times 17,429 is 636,367,648. It can do things that we can do, only it can do it faster and better. And robots, AI, they don't have all the emotions, the feelings that is hindering them from being better. Like, do you have your life together? Do you have your act together? I'm 40 and I don't have my life together. But these robots, this robot, they don't need to have their life together to evolve and grow. They just need more information, more technology. And we're just giving it to them. We're giving them. We're giving them the keys to the future. There are robots that can do anything. They can do math. They can write words. They can answer an email. They can cook your food. They drive cars. Robots are driving cars. I don't drive my eyesight's not very good, so I can't drive a car. And everyone's like, oh, so you must be really excited about self-driving cars. No, no, I'm not excited about self-driving cars because I don't trust the robots. I don't want a robot in charge of my life. I barely want another human being in charge of my life. I sometimes don't even want to be in charge of my own life. I don't like how it's growing and evolving and becoming bigger and better, whatever that means. So I need a foil hat. I need, I need to protect my brain. How to make a tin foil hat. How to build an effective tin foil hat. That's what I need, I need something effective. The goal of a tin foil hat is to shield a person's brain from electromagnetic radiation like radio waves. And robots. The goal is also to protect your brain waves from robots. But I'm not here to judge you on why you want to block them. I'm just here to help you block them using science. She's just here to help me. She's here to help us, humanity. If your budget allows, you'd be much better off with making your hat out of gold, silver, or copper foil instead. I do not have gold, silver, or copper foil. I have tin foil. I have aluminum foil. I have foil. I want to make a hat. This video is almost over, and I don't think she's going to tell me how to make a hat. She's in with the robots. She's trying to distract me. Okay, I found another video. Psst. Psst. It's Evan at Marvel's Kingdom. Hi, Evan. Today. We're making tin foil hats. So he gets it. He's whispering so the robots don't hear him too. Aliens can't read our minds. Or the robots. No, the robots kidding. can't read our minds. We're going to make them for fun. No, tin I'm making them for the robots. Perfect. So all you'll need for this is tin foil. I'm ready. Mine right here. I have mine so right let's here. Let's start with the classic tin foil hat. What you're going to want to do is stretch out your tin foil. Okay, I need space. Evan, you have to go over here. So to fold it in half. Have you ever tried to fold tin foil? This is not. I don't. It's so loud. Next, you're gonna take your tin foil and wrap it around your head, and then form it to your head with a point in the middle. My head is very small. Is that good? He told me to make a point, but now I look like a unicorn. The robots can still get in there. This isn't gonna work. This isn't going to work. I have to take matters in my own hands. I'm just gonna freehand this. My tin foil's broken. I am now fully protected from the robot. 